Good day, my name is Brayden and today I'm going to be showing you how to set your shortfall. So, first things first, you're going to go to Setup, then to Company, and from here you'll move over to the right. So what we want to do is we want to make sure that this little tick box over here is ticked, we want to make sure that Short Time is ticked, and we want to make sure that Absent Monday to Friday is ticked. Furthermore, we want to make sure that copy short for hours 2 is set to OT2. From there, you can save and close there. Then, we move on to the actual employees. So, we'll go to Employee Management, and we will select this employee here. Go to Shifts and Preferences, then Preferences. So, first things first, you want to make sure that this tick box over here, Exclude Short for and Set, is set to whatever time you want. I'm going to make nine hours. I'll we'll tick this tick box as well. For him, I'm going to just select monthly for his pay cycle, but the time-based calculation must be daily. Then I'm just going to set the same times, nine hours for Monday to Thursday, nine hours for Friday, and the same for these over here. Once that's done, you are pretty much all set. So you'll just have those tick boxes with those rules. Remember your pay cycle can be whatever you want, but your time-based calculation must be daily. You must make sure that all these tick boxes that I've ticked are in fact ticked, and from there you are good to go. Thank you for watching.